What are mechanical royalties? The simple understanding is that mechanical royalties are royalties that are paid to a songwriter whenever a copy of their song is made. As with many avenues in the music industry, it's always a little more complicated than it seems. We'll try to simplify it in this video. So, the songwriter is owed mechanical royalty whenever her song is printed on CD or vinyl, for example, label record prints CDs, downloaded digitally from iTunes and other digital stores, used as a ringtone, or streamed on interactive platforms like Spotify, Pandora, Deezer, etc. Just to clarify the last one, interactive streaming platforms are allowing the users to interact and demand what to listen, so they generate mechanical royalties. On the other hand, non-interactive platforms like AM, FM radios do not allow users to choose what to listen, and they are considered as public performances, so they generate performance royalties. The basic distinction between performance and mechanical royalties is that Performance royalties are licensing music to play it, and mechanical royalties are licensing music to sell it. Who pays mechanical royalties? Mechanical royalties are paid by whoever attains the mechanical license to reproduce and or distribute your music. It can go from record label or record company to anyone who wants to record a cover of your song. Songwriters can often make the mistake of thinking that being members of performance rights organizations will take care of their mechanical royalties. But these organizations only handle performance royalties. You will need to register with a separate collection agency that handles mechanical royalties. There are agencies like Harry Fox Agency, Easy Song Licensing, and Louder, where anyone can acquire mechanical licenses for a small fee for any song. These agencies can issue mechanical licenses, collect mechanical royalties, and distribute mechanical royalties to songwriters. The songwriter cannot deny giving mechanical license, so this license is pretty easy to get. All the registrations are usually done by the publishers. The songwriter also can decide if a share goes to another co-writer or a band member who contributed, but the basic rule is that all the mechanical royalties go to the songwriter. The current mechanical royalty rate for physical recordings and permanent digital downloads is 9.1 cents for recordings of a song not longer than 5 minutes, and 1.75 cents for every additional minute. This rate is determined by law. This means that anyone who gets a mechanical license is responsible to pay to the songwriter 9.1 cents for every print or downloaded copy of the song. Streaming platforms, on the other hand, have a mechanical rate that varies in the range from roughly 4% to 6.75% of revenue. Here is an example of how the process should work. A record label wants to print 5,000 CDs with 15 of your songs, all under 5 minutes, and sell the CD. He will need to get a mechanical license from the above mentioned agencies and pay $1.365 per CD printed. Note that he needs to pay for all the CDs created regardless if he sells them or not. The agencies will issue mechanical licenses and collect the royalties which later will be distributed to the songwriters. So in this case, the mechanical royalties for the songwriter will be $6,825. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel and connect with Coverworld on Facebook.